Well, hello everyone. I want to give you a warm welcome to my Ape SpongeBob SquarePants DVD review. Hope you're all having the most wonderful day today. Now, which SpongeBob SquarePants DVD will we be reviewing today? Well, I think a lot of you know what it is, unless you've checked my little list that I've done for episode 6 of this review series on the pinned comment. Today, we're doing a DVD review of Lost in Time, the SpongeBob SquarePants Lost in Time DVD. So, this DVD released in 2006 by Paramount and Nickelodeon. And as you can see on the front cover, it's got SpongeBob, it's got Patrick, they're being like Vikings as well, which is great. And what I love is on SpongeBob's shield right here, it has a pineapple on it, which is a bit like his pineapple house, which is what I really like. I just really like that. And yeah, and what's funny is the feather that's up on the top of uh, SpongeBob's hat Makes me think about Mr. Krabs' claw. I don't know why, but it just seems like it. And also on the front cover here, you've got the jellyfish, which is cool. And he, he looks kind of evil as well, because obviously this is like a Viking sort of time sort of DVD. So yeah, so this is the front cover. Of course, you've got SpongeBob, Patrick, and the shield and the jellyfish, which is nice. Includes a double length episode as well. So if you guys didn't know about that, nice. Here's the spine with a picture of Squidward on there. Very nice. And here's the back. So, episodes on this DVD are Dunkus and Dragons, two part episode, Selling Out, Funny Pants, Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy 7. I apologise if I've got that Roman numeral number wrong. The motion picture is what the uh, Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy episode is. Enemy in Law and Patrick Smart Pants. <laughs> nice, nice episodes on this DVD. So it was released in 2006 by Paramount and Nickelodeon. And it has a running time of approximately 81 minutes. Yeah, 81 minutes. So guys, sit back, relax and enjoy this special moment with me. Okay, okay there. So, on the front cover of the DVD, we have Spongebob here, that jellyfish that we just saw a minute ago as well, and all the information that's on here as well, like the logos and that. So, here's the DVD. Here's the back of the DVD. Very good. And now, into my PlayStation. There we go. Alright, guys, so I'll sit down onto my bed, and then we'll get straight into this review, guys. Okay, and you can see that SpongeBob game that I've I've seventy one percent completed that game now, which is amazing. Anyway, now guys, I'm gonna play from beginning because I've done uh, I've checked this DVD out before, and when I just start it normally, it won't start from the beginning. So we're gonna press that, and now it will actually come up. Now, before we actually get onto the home menu of this DVD, we actually see quite a lot of ads for the first time. For the first time in my review series, we're going to see a bunch of ads before we get to the home menu. Some being Spongebob ones as well, guys. But anyway, first we're greeted with the Nickelodeon logo, which is the fish again. Of course, we always get the fish. Now the language, of course, is English. And here's the copyright warning for this DVD. So, yeah. Okay. So we've got the copyright warning, but then it doesn't actually send me to the home menu. We've got a coming soon stuff here. So we've got some adverts coming. Now this is for SpongeBob SquarePants DVDs, as you can see. So as you can see here. We're going to you. Yep. Yep. So this is a SpongeBob SquarePants DVD advert, basically. Yep. And we've done a few DVD reviews of all these like clips as well in these um in these DVDs. Of course, I've only done eight episodes in this series so far, but we've seen a few clips of these. So yeah. Nice. Oh, blue jellyfish. Is that even an audience in the background? Yep, it used to be on VHS as well, but VHS has died away, of course. And then there's a few SpongeBob DVDs, and I've reviewed all those DVDs now, guys. Well, for the past eight episodes, we've got an Over the Hedge advert here, which is nice. I have seen this movie, it's interesting. So, yeah, 
This review is going to be a bit longer than usual, guys, because of all these ads, of course. <laughs> and it's made by DreamWorks as well. Nice. <laughs> okay, let's get to the next ad then. And this is a SpongeBob game for the PlayStation 2, by the way. Or was it the Nintendo Wii? I reckon. <laughs> yep. There's Plankton. What was this game? I need to check. Here we go. Look at that. Create Creature from the Krusty Krab, and it's available on the PlayStation 2. <laughs> nice. And I have no idea what that ad is. I think it was Avatar, but this is Avatar, The Legend of Aang. So, yeah. We'll skip this here. So, yeah, there's a bunch of ads before this goes to the home menu. But you can obviously press menu if you do want to go to the home menu quickly. Okay, we're going to skip these ads because we haven't got that much time. So, yeah. But anyway, we're going to go to the home menu now. And here we go. Cool opening screen there. <laughs> okay. Look at the way he just swung his... <laughs> okay, we have play all, audio options, episode selection, and special features. So audio options first. You've got... We've got Dewish. We've got English, Espanol, French, Portugal, and Netherlands there. That's basically the names of those countries. Episode selection... Of course, you've got all of the episodes right here. Apologies if this feels a bit rushed. I don't want to make this review very long today. But now we're going to go on to the special features. We've got Medieval Moments Joasting Practice Game Around the World with Spongebob. Let's go on to the game, guys. We're going to have a go. <laughs> we never get to play games on these reviews. Okay, here we go. Now, I have played this game before, guys, so I know what it's about. You gotta just follow where the arrows are going. Nice. Okay, I'm gonna try and do this while holding the phone and controlling it at the same time. Right, ready for this, guys? My God. Yes, down, up, right, up, down. There we are. Perfect. Let's see one more round, guys. There's three rounds in total, but we're gonna skip this uh, after this one. Okay, let's go. Up, right, up, down, up, right, down, left, down, up, down, left. Yes, there we go. Good job, that's great. Right, and finally, guys, we're going to go to the episodes. That took a while to load, but oh well. I'm just going to show one short clip of the Lost in Time episode. Skip the intro, of course. Look at this. Yep. Medieval moments. Great. Oh, let's see the bit where they're... Okay. Good evening, fair patrons of medieval moments. <laughs> nice. And then after this, they want to be yelled to go on stage. Let's see it. Let's see it. Let's see it. <laughs> Here we are. <laughs> You're in it. Yep. You never ride a seahorse. That's what we just played, by the way. And then they fight. Mr. Seahorse, sir. <laughs> You're gentle on beginners, aren't you? He's not gentle. <laughs> okay. Very funny. <laughs> oh, an old person as well. Right, guys. This review has gone on for long enough now. So we're going to end it there. But what a review this has been, guys. I've had a lot to say. I've had a lot to say. Almost not. It's been over nine minutes, this review. The longest one I've done in this series so far. But there you go, everybody. That wraps up this DVD review of SpongeBob SquarePants Lost in Time. Thank you for watching this, and I will see you guys in my next video. Farewell for now, everyone.